Well, good morning. Hello, how are we? Welcome back to a new vlog. Today's mission, we're going thrifting. I get requests all the time for thrifting videos, and I've done a few in the past, but not enough. So we're gonna go and see what we can find, see if we find any plus size gems. And I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride. And it's just gonna be like a day in my life otherwise. So I already had breakfast, and I've been letting that settle because all of a sudden, everyone's talking about how bad it is to have coffee on an empty stomach, and I don't always, but sometimes I do. And then it can like mess with your hormones. And as someone trying to get pregnant, I'm like, let's not do that anymore. <laughs> Busting out the merch. Wanna be barista. I've also got on the new little Skims sweatpants, the Terry ones. They're so nice. I'm sorry. I know so many people just like hate Kim and don't wanna buy Skims, but like Skims, I don't know. Their stuff just really, really hits different. And then this is that little uh, Amazon like tank set that I bought. Uh, it comes in a pack of three. I've been really wearing these like a lot. They're just like these little cropped ribbed tanks. I got the XL slash XXL. I got the blue pack and this is the long crop. They have different lengths. I would link them because they're like so cheap and like so good. A little sugar-free caramel. Ever since you guys told me this has to be refrigerated, I can't get it out. I did uh, heatless curls last night which was also the last vlog I did. And they totally got messed up overnight, so I'm just gonna leave them in like while I'm getting ready today. Got the blonde roast cold brew. My favorite, the sugar-free cinnamon roll. So good. And before we mix it, I just love when it's like all swirly. <laughs> My coffee straw, we all have a favorite. Mm -hmm. I have to do a little editing this morning before I get ready and I'm like, I need coffee. Mm. It's the first sip hit of the day. Anyway, I just wanted to intro the vlog. I will see you guys when we're getting ready to go thrifting. A few moments later. Okay, you guys, I'm about to get ready to head out. I actually have a few other errands, so we're gonna have a really fun day today. I also just took the dog for a walk before it gets like kind of warm later. We went on a nice long walk and now he's nice and tired, so I, I don't feel bad leaving him home. But yeah, I'm gonna do just like a really simple kind of everyday glam situation so i'm gonna watch some youtube while i get ready so let's do it Okay, here is the errands slash thrifting fit of the day. We've got Amazon leggings, my favorites. I will link this Etsy top. And then these are really old Gucci slides I've had for years. They're hanging on by a thread, but they're so broken in and comfortable. I refuse to get rid of them, even though they're like actually falling apart. Um, I just love this Etsy top with the hot pink 
lions or tigers i don't really know i'm also going to swing by bed bath and beyond because i guess they're having like a major closing sale um and i'm gonna see if they have any dyson vacuums for my friend <laughs> who's at work i'm gonna check for her and then just see if they have any other good stuff you know because everything i guess is like 70 percent off or something so let's go okay you guys we have switched to the car cam okay, vlogging on the phone because i can't bring my camera with me in stores i feel too awkward but first stop we're gonna run into bed bath and beyond because i don't want to wait too long to make sure because like i feel like those kind of things will go first you know like the most expensive things like a dyson vacuum those are gonna go first so um it's 11 15 hopefully i'm not too late and i can find her the vacuum i hope i can um and then after that we'll head over to i think savers because it's like right around i should probably do some research on some other good thrift stores around but i feel like you can't go wrong with like savers goodwill just like the classics so all right let's go to bed bath and beyond you guys it is absolutely popping it's so busy oh my god <laughs> i can like feel the anticipation Actually, I need a salad spinner. This is kind of exciting for me because I've been wanting to get one and now it's gonna be on sale. I don't know what is on sale. I'm guessing the whole store. I see no signs, but I can tell that like the whole place is nuts. I'm glad I came early though because there's still like a lot and stuff that we need for our house too. So I'm gonna have some fun for myself. I didn't know they sold this in store. I actually need refills for my cleaner, so gonna grab some here perfect i love these cleaning products blue land it's so good okay an unfortunate update the sale hasn't started yet that's why there's nothing anywhere <laughs> so it's like what am i missing i just asked a guy who works here and he was like we don't know it's changing every day like it might start tomorrow or the next day but call them every morning and find out so that's why the sale like the big closing sale hasn't started yet so I'll have to tell my friend. <laughs> Maybe I can come back for her in like a day or two while she's at work. Okay, I honestly feel like everyone thinks the sale is now because like the vibe is giving that. <laughs> like everyone's in there with carts. Like there's empty walls. Like it just feels like it should be a sale today, but it's not. So um, that was a flop. I put the salad spinner back. <laughs> I'm gonna come back when the sale starts. So another day. Now to savers. You guys, it's a good day. I'm so happy I found this. My mom had painting like this when I was a kid and I've always looked for it online and I can't believe it's here for $5. Like I literally wanna cry, this is a miracle. I'm so happy, yay. All right, let's keep going with the home stuff. I love this. So many pretty bowls. Oh, I love these. These are so pretty. It's an avocado. You guys, I found the same salad spinner, the OXO one I was gonna buy for five bucks, and I'm just gonna like wash the crab out of it. Yay, what a find. Oh my god, stop. This is so cute. You could just paint it. Okay, we're gonna check out the clothes. All right, you guys, time to head home and do a haul. The thing about savers is though, 
it's like always a war zone. It gives me a lot of anxiety just because the aisles are really narrow. The carts are too big to fit in the aisles, like especially with two people, it's just like a lot. And um, I feel like people are always kind of on a mission in there. They're like, they're not there to play. And as someone that like just in general gets anxiety while like shopping or in stores, um, it, it was a lot. Um, I did end up buying a uh, reusable bag though at the end, it was really cute. I love reusable bags. I need to start keeping them in my car. Um, but yeah, I got some really good stuff for like 70 bucks. I got like kind of a lot. And I swear if you got all that at like Target, it would be like 300. So let's go home and do a little haul. A few minutes later. Okay, you guys, back home. Obviously, we're gonna get into our thrift haul first and foremost. This was so exciting to find when I walked in. As I said, my mom always had kind of like cherub artwork. And I don't know if she had this one specifically, or there was one with like two kids. I don't know, it, I'm pretty sure it was this one, but I love it, it reminds me of my mom. I love the gold frame, I've been very into like this kind of antique gold frame look lately, so this was a great find for five bucks. And I'm not kidding, I think it's really funny that we went to Bed Bath & Beyond and almost bought the OXO salad spinner, and then I found it for five bucks at Savers. So it gives me a little skeeves buying something like this, um, but it works perfectly. And these are really pricey. There's the stopper over here. I thought it was this and I'm like, oh no, it doesn't work, but it's this button, it works. Um, I'm gonna look up how to like really deep clean this. I'll probably soak it, I don't know, like vinegar, baking soda, soap. I'll just make sure it's deep, deep, deep clean. Um, but overall, this is a great find. Okay, so let's get into the clothes. I didn't get like anything super exciting, but I did find some good stuff. So I grabbed two tanks and they're in like perfect condition. And I love they had um, both built-in bras. I love that for lounging. I got this cute, like kind of peachy pink color. And then this really pretty mint color. These are both just a couple bucks. And like I said, there's no stains or anything. They're in perfect condition. Like I just bought some like that from Skims in terms of like the style and shape. I love sleeping in those, lounging in those, especially now that it's spring and summer. And I just thought the colors were so pretty. I grabbed this for my mom. <laughs> she is gonna love this. This is so her style. It's this cute dress from Talbot's. It's her size, navy blue and white stripes, her fave, these cute little three quarter ruffle sleeves. It's really nice quality, brand new pretty much. Like it looks like it's never been worn. So I had to grab it for her cause it just screams my mom. Next up I grabbed a pair of flare leggings. It's an inside joke at this point. These are from Skechers. Um, I got the extra large and they look great. I actually, kind of love that they have back pockets. It's either gonna look really good or really stupid, but I figured I would give it a whirl. I've been really into flared leggings slash yoga pants rather than just regular leggings lately. Um, so I really like these. They're the perfect little bit of flare, maybe more of a boot cut actually. They have side pockets as well. Just a really nice, stretchy, good fabric. So good find. I got two pairs of jeans that look like they're gonna be really good. Um, so the first one here is from Eloquy, size 18, six bucks. These are really cool because they've got the pleating in the front. I don't have anything like that. And they are massively wide. Like, look at how wide they are. They're so cool and baggy and different. And I just think I can make some really fun outfits with these. And I've actually been wearing a lot of like wide leg pants lately, but those are like extra wide, so. It was a risk, but I think they will look good. And then I got a pair for $10.99 from American Eagle. Oh my God. They're doing construction and it just like shook the whole house. That scared me so bad. Oh, it's like a street over. That was scary. So the 90s boyfriend jeans. And I think they might be, these might be short, but I like that because then they show a little bit of ankle. So I'm really excited that I found these. And then the last thing I got are these really cute pull-on pants. These are actually from Dress Barn, but they're really cute pull-on kind of cargos in this really cute mint green color, kind of like a straight leg, has a stretchy waistband, and then these kind of cargo pockets. But I'm really into like pull-on pants lately and that kind of cargo look, and it's a really pretty muted minty color. I thought these were super cute for spring, and these were eight. 49. So all in all, 
really good. All that stuff would have been a lot more than the $68. Let me know if you guys want more thrifting content because I did find a lot of other thrift stores in the area that I could go to. These just came in from Amazon. Bruno loves these. He's over there going ham. These um, Mighty Paw Yak Cheese Dog Chews, <laughs> they last forever. It's literally just milk, lime, and salt, only three ingredients, high protein, um, and they're really hard and they just take forever for them to eat. So these are from Amazon, I'll link them. I don't know what we're gonna get up to the rest of the day. I really need to get a pedicure. It's 1.30, I'm gonna heat up some lunch and if I'm feeling it, I'll get a pedicure later, but if not, we'll just go tomorrow. A few moments later. Okay, so I've been editing for a little bit. I think I am gonna go get a pedicure. <laughs> so I changed from my leggings to my Skims Terry fleece sweats. The pinks match so perfectly, and I just tied this up. Bruni, who's on my hand? Jump. Look at that cute face. I think I'm gonna get some sort of red on my toes, so let's go. Toes are done, really pretty red back home. I am going to take off my makeup for the day. It's like five o'clock. All right, I wanted to show you guys where I put my new painting. I love it. It's in the entryway between the front door and the study, perfect spot. Cause then over here is this little mirror. So I think it kind of contrasts nicely, but it's so cute. Seriously, I love. Okay, now it is time to wash this. Filling up the sink with hot water, vinegar, and dish soap. And we're gonna give it a good soak. And this is also dishwasher safe. So I'm gonna soak it and run it through the dishwasher. Um, let me get this tag off. A few minutes later. When I say this is actually like so sad, I have them soaking and I come over to um, see how they're doing. I don't know, why am I checking on soaking dishware? Um, so I go to just see if I can take this apart, you know, cause like there's crevices in here and I wanna be able to scrub it. And then I got the top part off. It's freaking dirty. And I'm like, ugh, gross, nothing we can't fix. Then this thing falls out and it's now stuck between these two layers. <laughs> and I'm like looking up instructions on how to get it out. But I think I broke it. I'll keep checking for a bit. Keep letting it soak. It's not looking good though, my friends. Tomorrow. In case you guys want to know how every morning starts here, Yarvin, Yarvin puts on uh, some sort of music on the HomePod in the kitchen and... Uh, it's a party. I need my caffeine to hit. Yarvin wakes up injected with caffeine, I swear. We're like the opposites. Like I have so much energy in the morning, you have so much energy in the evening. And it's rough. I get on my bullshit at night. I don't know about you guys. I saw a girl on TikTok talk about nighttime zoomies as like a, a girl. Yeah. And how at night you just like get this like this boost and you just like want to be on your bullshit <laughs> as a girl. I don't know. Yeah, that's me in the morning. And that's you in the morning. So we compromise. We we make it we make it work for Afternoons each other. Afternoons are best for us. Afternoons are our happy place. That was bad. horrible. The afternoons are our happy place. After more research and discussion, I can keep drinking caffeine, just not a lot, which is what I'm doing. So I've been told to just keep doing what I'm doing. Um, Cause I know I had mentioned briefly like giving up caffeine. Um, I don't know, I just really don't know. But I was looking up fertility boosting foods and I just placed our grocery order. So I'm gonna get some other stuff. I mean, it's a lot of just like antioxidants, fruit and veg. One thing I saw was sunflower seeds, salmon, so. I've got salmon. I think I'm gonna make salmon for lunch. Oh, are you cuddling with your dad? Anyway, I'm going to the gym. It's leg day and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, you guys, I just went to the gym and scooted back up again to Bed Bath & Beyond cause like supposedly the sale was gonna maybe start today. And after Googling it too, a lot of things said April 26th, which is today. Um, so I pull up there, I see no signs or anything anywhere. And there's a very nice looking lady as I'm about to pull in. I'm like, and she came out with bags. I was like, was there anything on sale? And she goes, hardly anything unless you want coffee. And I'm like, okay, I love you, first of all. Um, but I guess like there's hardly anything on sale. It's not like a whole shebang. Um, I'm wondering if they're gonna maybe like slowly do rolling out sales and stuff. Um, 
And like, it's not like at that point where it's like big closeout sale yet, you know? So I don't know. I don't know what the tea is on this, but I'll continue to uh, see how it goes. I always sanitize my hands after the gym and I forgot. Um, and now I'm going to go to do a deposit at the bank and then we're going to go grab the Whole Foods pickup order. I took some salmon out of the freezer to make for lunch. Um, I think for lunch today, I usually just like pan sear my salmon in a skillet on the stove. Uh, but I think this time I'm going to do it in the air fryer. I've been seeing a lot of people do it like cubed and like seasoned really nice with like honey and chili flakes and then they do it in the air fryer in cubes and that just looks immaculate so i think i'm gonna do that for lunch and we'll try it out together so i will see you guys when we're home with our groceries all right i am back home i figured i would do a grocery haul just because i'm gonna put everything away grabbed some rayos i should have grabbed more when it was on sale because when it's not on sale it's like a dagger in my heart tonight we're having marinated chicken green beans and some pilaf you know we gotta always keep the chobani stocked up greek yogurt is apparently another fertility boosting food light mozzarella string cheese yars green juice his breath be smelling like grass when he drinks it <laughs> some peppers that are frozen so easy highly recommend having those if you're gonna whip up like fajitas or I don't know, like a scramble. You guys, this is one of the best ranches ever. This one from Whole Foods. The classic ranch dressing and dip. It's organic, I don't know, it's just so good. There's something about it. Egg whites, chase. I still have some leftover meat, but for the rest of the meals of the week, I needed another pack of chicken. Croutons for salad, bananas, apples, oranges, grape tomatoes, Yars orange juice. You know the drill, we always keep a small milk in the house. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's corn season. So I got a couple ears of corn on the cob. I love corn on the cob so much. I really like corn. So we're gonna have like turkey burgers one night with some corn, mini cucumbers, my fave. I'm gonna have some with hummus. You guys, this is finally back in stock. I love this marinade. I'm gonna marinate our, marinate our chicken in this all day today and then cook it up tonight. The honey soy ginger marinade from 365 is so delicious, so delicious. Like. This, you don't need to season your chicken at all. It's baffling how much flavor this has. Like, let it soak for the day, even just a few hours, um, and then I just cook it up in a pan with a little avocado oil on the stove. Oh my gosh. And then lastly, this huge box of spring mix for salads. So, all right, I'm gonna put this away, take a shower, and then we'll make, actually, I might make my lunch before I shower. I don't know, we'll see. guys look how good this salmon looks i just did an air fryer for five minutes on 400 and i seasoned with salt pepper garlic powder paprika a little bit of honey and chili flakes and like the tiniest bit of coconut aminos as well and it just smells so good so let's do a taste test i'm so glad i finally busted out my old air fryer because i like forgot how good it is just how quick and easy everything is in the air fryer all right let's see Oh my god, that's so good. A few moments later. Okay, you guys, I just took a shower, threw in a little dry shampoo, throwing up my hair. I am going to end this vlog here because I'm going to start another one with spring cleaning, which I've been totally putting off. So stay tuned for that in the next vlog. But I hope you guys enjoyed this thrift one. Let me know, again, if you want more thrifting content. And I love you so much. I'll see you soon. Bye.